you guys my dad plant look how beautiful i never come out here i'm up my parents house guys for the weekend and i just came out to check on the dog and i was like oh my gosh look how beautiful these flowers are <laughs> so gorgeous i'm looking for my dog hey <laughs> I just wanted to introduce the vlog here and say good morning it is currently 6 30 in the morning but good morning i am currently sipping on my yogi detox tea and just introducing the vlog and getting ready for work it's thursday so i'll be heading out the door in about 30 minutes so yeah just wanted to say hi happy cinco de mayo guys today is cinco de mayo so in honor, I am having me a margarita with uh, this Avion tequila. Also, I wanted to share with you guys this Happy Mother's Day candle. No, I'm not a mom. I do strive to be a mother one day, a mother one day. And no, I was not about to get this candle, give this candle to my mom because I actually got her the iPhone 12. But I wanted to share with you this gorgeous candle from Bath & Body Works. It's in the flavor of champagne toast. And if you are a Bath & Body Works lover, you know that champagne and toast smells absolutely gorgeous. So I just want to get on the vlog really quick and share this with you guys. And I'm just going to have me a good old margarita. Guys, happy Santa Maya. I got me a little margarita and tacos. Okay, y'all, I'm back again. It is the Friday before Mother's Day. So, I went ahead and got my mom and my grandmother their flowers. When I tell y'all, they are absolutely gorge. Oh, my God. So, now, I am off to go and um, grab a nothing but cake. So, this is what we're doing for Mother's Day. Um, I got my mom some flowers. I got her the iPhone 12 is what she wanted. And so, just pick those flowers up because I got her iPhone last week. So, we're going to go ahead and pick her up those flowers and then get her a nothing but cake. Grab her a candle. We got my grandmother flowers. And so, tomorrow is Saturday. We're going to go eat. I think, I'm not sure where we're going. We're just going to go to Max's this place that we eat at a lot. But um, my little cousin has a game and all of my family is going to be there. And we're also going bowling. So on Sunday, everybody will kind of do their own thing. Like I'll be going out of town and um, like all my cousins and my aunts and them, they'll do their own things with their own personal family. So I went ahead and just got my mom her stuff out of the way. I'm going to take it over there today. And yeah, I'm so excited. My grandmother loves flowers. I was just telling my boyfriend how... My grandma is always, she's where I got like my feminine side for, like how I love home decor, flowers, cooking, and all that stuff like that. I got that from her. So I grabbed her some flowers. She's going to be ecstatic. And um, I'm not going to get her a nothing but cake because she has diabetes. And I don't want that to, you know trigger anything because my grandma will eat it so <laughs> i don't even want to tease her so yep that's what i'm out doing i'm gonna show y'all the flowers as soon as i stop and then um i got to stop at nothing but cakes and i'm gonna get my mom a little cake because she doesn't need a whole one <laughs> and then um after that i gotta go back to the office for a couple of more hours just to get some stuff done before the weekend because my boss is out today so i gotta do some extra i'm gonna grab me a salad and then i'm gonna go see my mom and my grandmother i'm so excited but yeah i just want to let y'all know what i had going on and i'm gonna show y'all the flowers in a sec so see you guys in a sec all right guys so these are the beautiful flowers i did not forget the hall the h&m hall see the h&m bag is right there but look how gorgeous these are for my mom and then i got the white roses for my grandmother so yeah and then i'm at nothing but cake picking up a little mini cake for my mom a little treat for herself y'all look how beautiful it is out here i am getting ready to get my saturday started it is a saturday before um before mother's day ew my lips are sticky 
but today's gonna be a fun day um I got my hair done this morning um I hate um gosh but um <laughs> y'all I'm getting ready to go and meet my family I think I told y'all on the previous clip that we're going to where are we going we're going to my little cousin's game they both got games today and then we are going to brunch with my mom my cousins and one of my cousin's friends so we're getting ready to do that and then later on we're going bowling just hanging out with family um my little brother is graduating high school this year and so me and my aunt are in charge of the party the cookout so i gotta meet her today and we're just gonna finish paying for stuff invoices and things of that nature make sure our guest list is good to go and yeah it's gonna be a family filled day and then tomorrow is actual mother's day we're going out of town to my boyfriend's family they live like an hour away and then we're gonna go to church with them and after that we'll come back and be with my mom so yeah just want to give you guys an update it's so beautiful out i got on my shades from free people this little dress from boohoo and i got on my I should have put my TV was on, but it's okay. I got on my um, Birkenstocks. So, I'm just real chill, comfy. And I will catch you guys when we get to the kids' basketball game. Yeah, that's awesome. How many games are they playing? Huh? So, this is cute. Who did this? Come on. Who did it this morning? Who laid your edges, baby? Y'all check my sister's hair out, period. Period. Oh, bundles. <laughs> At the volleyball game. This is our Mother's Day brunch with my mom, my aunt, my cousin. And we're at what's the name of this restaurant, Maya? The name of this restaurant? Say it over for the people. Period. All right, y'all. So whatever, we're here. Let me just tell y'all how long it took me to try to get this set up good enough for me to do this little mini haul. I am coming to you raw, raw. Okay, because my hair not done. I got this hat on. And I didn't put on the face to show y'all this. So, let me fix my ring light. Y'all, I just been having technical difficulties. However, I am here and I am here to share a long-awaited Zara Hall H&M. I have an H&M bag. And as well as my fave, Nordy. <laughs> so, let's get right to it. I am going to be showing you guys my brand new pair Tory Burch Miller sandals that I purchased about two weeks ago from Nordstrom's. Here they are. I have not worn them yet. I got them in, let's focus, the silver color. These are the ones that just came out this year. They had uh, another silver pair that came out last year, but these are the most recent ones. These are in the metallic silver. So it comes like this. I don't know if you guys have the Tory Burch Millers, but let me just tell y'all, these shoes last a lifetime. I've had the black ones since about 2017, and they're the shiny black ones, and they have just been my holy grail. They are my best friend. I use them, dress them up, dress them down. So I was like, let me just go ahead and invest in another pair because why not? I wanted to get a new pair, but since I got so many pair of brown sandals for the summer, I was like, let me just get something that's gonna elevate my wardrobe. that will take it up a little notch and 
boom, bam. So they come with this little dust bag. It just comes with one dust bag. I don't know if y'all know, but a lot of higher ends, they come with two dust bags. But the Tory Burch Millers, they come with one. So this is my receipt. It's from Nordstrom's and I paid $192 for these. They were originally $198, but I had some Nordy points, so I, were able, so I was able to use those. And here they are. Like I said, I never wore them before, but I just think that they are so freaking cute. Guys, hot girl summer. So these are it. The other pair, they're still wrapped up. I actually took these out of the wrapper because I wanted to try them on. Now, the other pair that I got, I got in a size 12, my black ones, but um, when I was in the store, they didn't have a 12, and I tried these 11s on, and the sales associate was like, Courtney, they look so good on your feet. So, why not? So, that's them. I'm going to put this box out, guys. Um, Then, I'm going to show you some more goodies that I got from Zara, which there are more shoes. Would y'all seen the shoe haul that I had in my last vlog? But let me just tell y'all, I went on the Nordstrom, the Zara site, and I was on the phone with my best friend. So if you're watching, Jessica, she made me do it. She made me buy these two pairs of sandals. Did not want to. <sighs> However, I could not leave these, y'all. I wore these. If you follow me on Instagram, you would have seen that I wore these when I uh, carried my Coach Tabby. These are in the size 42. Y'all know, again, these are equivalent to 11s and 12. I have big feet, so that's why I like sharing my shoes with a lot of you. If you have big feet, we can still be cute too. So I got these. These are very, very comfortable. Oh my goodness. And they are so freaking cute. So that's these. Let me grab the other one. That's how they look together. Let me move the bag. They come in this little cute little dust bag. It just come with one dust bag. I said, okay, Zara. I see y'all. But these are it. Aren't they so cute, y'all? So that's them. And then I could not leave these. Those were, I think, 50, if I'm not mistaken. Don't quote me, y'all. When I went on the Zara site the other day, sorry. I went on the Zara site, I think it was yesterday, and they still had both pair of these sandals. I went on the Nordstrom site as well. They have these in stock. You can read the reviews on Nordstrom's, and as far as Zara, they don't have any reviews listed, but I'm telling you, I love Zara shoes. They fit so well. And these are the other pair. These are so cute, y'all. Look at those. Oh my God. Ah! These are in a 42 too, which is an equivalent to an 11. No, yeah, these were $29.99. So these were $30 to US dollars. So that's that for y'all. And like I said, this is a little mini haul. Hmm, that's all I'm about. I wanna show you guys what I got from H&M. I had a couple of returns. So I'll show y'all everything. Some of this stuff is from like, we went to the beach in March. So I had was gonna take this little jogger set, but I really don't like the way it fit. This is a size 2X. This is in a straight size though, y'all. But it's just a sweater. This is a sweater. Let me step back so y'all can see it. So I just got this little sweater. I didn't buy this today. I had already had it, but I was going to return it. But it didn't have anything that I liked, so I was like, I'll just keep it for next year. So that's the sweater, and then it came with these joggers. These are two X as well. These are really, really big on me, so I might just actually keep this for like loungewear, just lounge around the house with it, because they are just way too big for me, and they're in an XXL. So sometimes I'm telling y'all, even though you're in plus size, you can definitely shop um, H and M straight sizes because listen, these are in straight sizes, and this is a, they're XXL in straight sizes, and they are way too big for me. So it's just you just got to be able to look at the material, and that's how they look. They like joggers, and I really don't like the way this fits. So I might just keep this to keep it around to um, wear it around the house. So these are the basics. 
let's just say basic like jogger so i'll probably just keep these nothing fancy i don't really get nothing that's fancy fancy you know and then i got this dress thought it was really cute i got some um can y'all see it this peach looking dress I love H&M dresses, and this was $34.99, but y'all, they dresses fit so freaking comfortable. Like, I got some more dresses. I'll show y'all in a different video from H&M, and I can't think of the style of the dress. Hold on. It's right here. I'm going to show it to y'all, but their dresses fit just, oh my God, so comfortable and so cute. You can just throw it on, and it honestly feel like you're on, you're wearing like a nightgown. And like I said, this one was $34.99. And this is in the plus size. So this is in a size 2X. But I just thought this was really cute. Of course, I'm going to have to go across the steamer with it. And I actually might wear this tomorrow, depending, depending upon the weather. Wear this tomorrow with my, with my little Tory Burch flip flops. But this is the dress. This is wasn't supposed to be around. A, ugh, sorry, y'all. This, this dress was not supposed to be a part of the haul. But since I was telling y'all how comfortable H&M dresses are, my dress is right here. So, I'm going to show it to you really quick. They don't give you, like, the names. But anyways, if you follow me on Instagram, I had the leopard one on the other day and on my story, so you would saw that. But they are so freaking comfortable. So, I have a leopard one, and then I got, like, a, I got a leopard one, and then, like, a tiger print one. But when I tell y'all these dresses are the most freaking comfortable dresses ever, it doesn't say how much I pay for these, but I'm almost positive that they're $19.99 and I have three of them. And baby girl, I'm going to be wearing these all summer. Really cute. And I bought these hoops. Now listen, y'all, I don't wear earrings, but I just needed a new pair of hoops. So I thought they were cute. So... I'm gonna bust these out as well. But these are so cute, aren't they? Not too big. I'm gonna try to take really good care of them because I don't want them tarnishing. Um, I have eczema really bad around my ear and my, I have really bad like eczema and dry skin and as well as acnetic. So if you see me, I really don't wear a lot of jewelry and that's because I try to prevent breakouts. But I can see me wearing these for a couple of hours just to be cute. Like if I'm running on like a little date night or hanging out with the girls just to elevate the look i just thought that these were really cute and then i also bought these basic um i was saying earlier that i could not think of what are these things called but these basic biker shorts and i want to get into like wearing like graphic tees and my tee was and stuff just for like chill days so i won't be looking crazy like how i look now i just need clothes to like throw on so i was like let me try these out so i got these and these are in the 2x as well and i paid 9.99 for these and also y'all i got them in black i thought these were cute too like i said this were graphic tees and i got some dresses too that i might can put these up under or like some little crop tops with my Tevas and my Birkenstocks that you guys seen. So I thought these were really cute to like wear with that. So I need to work on getting me like some basic tops. But guys, that's just the end of this portion of the vlog. I just wanted to show you some things that I had picked up within the last couple of days and share it with you guys. And if I can find any of these products, I would try my best to link them below. If you have any questions, definitely list them below um, and I'll be sure to answer any questions or concerns that y'all may have. Thank y'all for watching and being so supportive. I am a new YouTuber, so thank you so much for your nice comments and your likes and things of that nature. Um, yeah, so I just wanna show y'all what I had. Um, I'll get back to the regular vlog if I do anything else. Fun in particular, I will definitely hop back on and show my girls. So, bye y'all.